Well, this weekend, there just wasn't a basketball game. There was a fierce competition of brains and beauty, and it was the Miss Arizona USA pageant. And our very own Miss Arcadia is here with us. <laughs> Faith Ferris, our coordinating producer who participated. How are you, Miss Faith? I'm doing good. So, I'm doing good. Okay. I got in trouble yesterday, and I want to apologize out there because we were having fun. We were talking about how hard you work from your workouts, of course, to your eating. And I said, well, Faith wasn't eating. I meant to say Faith wasn't eating junk food or anything. Like, you mm -hmm. went on this really big, healthy diet. You looked amazing there on the Thank stage. You. Um, and it was a lot of hard work for this, wasn't it? Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah, I definitely ate. My trainer makes sure that I eat a lot. Like I started eating more than I ate before I started training because yeah. you're burning so much more energy. But this weekend, it was stressful. I packed tons of snacks, so I made sure that I stayed eating and <laughs> hydrated on all that kind of stuff. So it, it was a good weekend. All right, let's go to the competition because one, it was Zoomed and we were all gonna get out there, but the monsoon hit and so we all kind of like backed off. Mm -hmm. and we're like, oh, let's just Zoom the party. Yeah. So we did, we had, it was really great watching. You, I, I'll tell you, your hard work paid off. You were amazing on that stage. I don't know, do we have any shots of her? Do we, there we go. There goes you with the group of ladies. And yes. this was actually almost a friendship building kind of competition I could say too because you guys all built up a great you know friendship out there didn't you oh yeah the one of the main reasons I joined the competition was to just get a good group of girlfriends and that's exactly what I got out of this weekend and I met so many other amazing women that I've been interacting with on social media that we've just become the bestest of friends and I know those are going to be actual lifelong friendships so I honestly got the most out of the weekend with that and it was just really great okay now it's time for the hard question. I'm sorry, I know you told me not to, but I have to do this. But how did you keep it together knowing that the hair, the makeup, the dress was all done right and everything like that? And then the monsoon hit, and you, lady, I, I, you couldn't tell on stage what was going on backstage, but I saw some pictures. Honestly, it was insane. So you can see here, we had to, we went from one building outside into the theater. So our all of our volunteers had to carry umbrellas, had to carry plastic tubs <laughs> above our heads. We had to get our garment gowns and like put our entire train into the garment gown and then put it on top of us, and then they put a trash bag or a <laughs> container on top of us. So oh it was God. insane. Like, it was, even our director, Brett, was like, I have never seen this in the however many years she's been running the pageant. This is the craziest thing that has ever happened. Yeah. So it, it not, was, not only that, but when we were in the hotel, a huge dust storm came in, blew all the dust into the hotel, set off the fire alarms. You had <laughs> girls running down with their dresses thinking they were about to catch on fire. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It was insane. Oh, man. Well, uh, we do have to say congratulations to, to you for participating and being there. Thank um, you. And then who, I, actually, I didn't get to see on Sunday. Because so Sunday, Cass. Oh, so. I'm blanking. Uh-oh. I'm blanking. I you know. just made me blink. Well, I think we have video of do the we, new Miss Arizona we, USA. Okay, good, because right? where she's yeah, from so is Yeah, so Usury Mountain. Yeah, yeah where's yeah. Usury Mountain? I actually have no idea. Oh, yeah. Cassidy Jacks. It's Cassidy Jacks. Oh, Cassidy Jacks. Yep. Okay. So she won the Miss Arizona USA. Look at that. And then our beautiful team Mackenzie from Peoria, she won our team category. And that's Mackenzie right there. That's she great. She's the sweetest girl ever. And so now they go off to Miss USA, is that yes. what happens? Yes, Miss USA and Miss Team USA. I know Miss USA is Thanksgiving weekend. I'm not sure, did I just say Miss USA? Because I don't know when Miss Team USA is. Okay, I think it's but... like, kind of, doesn't run the same weekend or no? Not for sure. No, but it's, it's very close. So. Yeah. And, and I'll tell you, this, this pays off in great ways because you've already been asked for another uh, party, oh, haven't you? Yeah. So. so I had another director reach out to me asking me if I wanted to participate. But you know what? It's so fresh right now that I kind of just want to live in the in. moment and take it all in and, you know, so. see what's And, and how long do you get to wear the sash? You just get to wear it all? Cause... Honestly, this might be the last time I wear the sash. Really? I mean. I, I would keep it. I would wear it all the time. New girls are going to start uh, signing up for next year's pageant. So. But we'll see. We'll see. There you go. Can you go again? Can you sign up again? I can. I, yeah. So the age limit is 28, but that's on the 1st of January, and I turn 28 on the 3rd of January. So we will see. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I'll tell you. Thank you, Faith. Thank you. Thank you.